So I'm on another cruise ship. If you didn't know, I'm actually a musician on cruise ships. And uh, yeah, so i uh, gonna be gone for a week, but hopefully I'll get some more videos out for you regarding the Action 4 because that's what we're talking about today. I'm gonna tell you six more things about the Action 4 that you might not know about. And if you haven't yet, check out my 12 things about the Action 4 video. Um, yeah, there's a lot of fun stuff I'm discovering all the time. So let's just get right to it. Mr. Black. And by the way, welcome to the channel. My name is Danny Black, and I love to share with you cool gear that comes my way and also show you some tips and tricks on how to use that gear sometimes. And if you like that kind of stuff, don't be a stranger. Click that button right there, and I'll put links to everything that you can find easily down in the description, plus a surprise link. And if you couldn't tell, just look closely in the reflection of my glasses. I'm actually filming with the Action 4 right now. It's been a fantastic camera to film with, like just on a lot of videos that I make, it's just been so easy to use. By the way, it's like noon here and we sail away at four. I have a sound check at two. So if I can edit this video and upload it before we sail away, that's gonna be a miracle and uh, hopefully we can do that. So first thing I wanna tell you is that when you're using Hyperlapse, there's a really cool feature here where you can actually make it real time. So if you go into your modes and you go to time-lapse, you can switch it over to Hyperlapse. And then when you're actually doing your Hyperlapse, look down at the bottom left-hand side and it will be on auto, you switch it over to 1X. It goes from like the fast motion to just regular real time. So if like you were navigating around the ship like this, yeah, it can be going really fast. And then maybe I just wanna highlight one part like the logo so I can put it in that real time and then I'll go back to Hyperlapse. That's a really cool feature. The next thing I wanna share is the SD card. The big thing about the SD card is it's spring loaded. Check out this shot. Like we're gonna press this in and it's gonna shoot out. So be careful of that. You know, that's also an easy way to get your SD card out. And the SD card that I use is the SanDisk Extreme Pro, at least up to 128 gigs. I feel like 128 gigs is the best because uh, you don't want to have limited space, but you don't want to have too much space where if you lose it or something happens to that SD card, you won't lose as much stuff. But in regard to that, file transfer is actually really easy on the Action 4. You just plug it into your computer via USB-C and it will prompt you whether you want it to be webcam mode or file transfer and you click file transfer and it's just that easy. It just shows up like a hard drive and you can get all your stuff just that simple. Okay, the other thing is if you want to get better low light shots, you take off the glass one and it comes with this little plastic one that you can put on there. Now that makes it not waterproof, so be careful of that, but that will just eliminate the glass aspect of it. So in low light, it will actually look a little bit sharper, a little bit better. All right, next on the list, some people have been asking about is whether the Action 2 accessories will work, like the mount accessories work with the Action 4. And actually, yes, it does work. I have the Ulanzi one right here. This is a nice little ball head that has a, a cold shoe mount on the side and you can put that on a tripod. Yeah, Telesyn and Ulanzi both have great accessories for the Action 4 that were designed for the Action 2, which is great. Now, the only thing it doesn't do is it doesn't, you can't, uh, you can't use the ones with USB-C and charge it at the same time because there's not a charging module at the bottom. But still, these are fantastic and I'll put links down in the description and some of them have coupon codes. The other thing is with the USB out to like a 3.5 millimeter or eighth inch jack, if you wanted to go to like a lav mic or like another microphone, you can't just use any of the ones that just look like that because a lot of them are outputs to like headphones that you would get for like your iPads or things like that. But uh, this one right here, and I'll put the link in the description for this one exactly. So, and this is what the lavalier sounds like. And another tip is if you're seeing it like showing red, like it's peaking, you can just go into the settings on the side and you can see a little mic icon and you could actually adjust your gain levels. And right now this is actually at negative six. So that uh, is a good way to adjust those levels. And sticking with the mics, someone was asking about the DJI wireless mics and instead of just plugging it in with USB-C, they're wondering if they can go out of the receiver and into the Action 4 with a USB-C to USB-C cable because they wanted it a little bit more secure on a, on a cage or something. And it does work, yeah, if you plug in the receiver, go out USB-C into the Action 4 USB-C, it still works just like it would uh, the other way that, that I actually currently have it in now. And a bonus one here, if you haven't checked out my last video where I talk about the GPS remote, check that out because you can do all the GPS overlays and stuff like that. And uh, yeah, I mean, there's a lot more that we can talk about, so stick around, stay tuned, I'll do more videos on that and even more really cool Action 4 accessory videos. Uh, I gotta get this video out before we sail away. So um, if you're watching this, right now and uh it worked so uh <laughs> thanks so much for watching thanks to everyone that subscribed and helped this channel grow and uh 
I'll be making a lot of videos on the ship and it's gonna be a lot of fun and maybe even some music stuff because uh, that's what I do here, but who knows. So thanks again for watching and I'll see you next time. Actually, for the thumbnail, just help me out here. I'm just gonna hold this up and put an action for it in there because uh, make it look like very cruisy, huh? Cruise ship. Four things you.